Well, hey there, this is uh, Chase Wick recording a Screencast-O-Matic video. And in this recording, I'm recording my desktop right there, but the, the webcam is on, so you can see me as well. This is a really cool video because people get to know you and see that you're a real person, and you can also share your screen. Now, what I do a lot of times is I prepare ahead of time. I'm going to open up a new window in Google Chrome. I'm going to make the window small so you can see how I kind of, um, I'm going to make it smaller so we can see. I prepare ahead of time and get tabs ready before I start the recording. Let's say that I wanted to talk about YouTube, so I would get this done before the recording. Maybe the, the, the concept is just talking about the power of YouTube, how you can use YouTube in your uh, business to record videos and attract people to your business. In the other part of that, I might want to open up another tab. Again, I would do this ahead of time, not live as I'm doing it here. But then let's say that you want to show how you can attract people to whatever by the use of a capture page and autoresponder. So now I have two tabs. You could have multiple tabs, but right now I have two tabs, and I can just flick or click between the two tabs talk about the capture page, talk about the power of the autoresponder. And if I really go in depth with the autoresponder, why not open up the autoresponder page that really speaks to what I'm talking about? So here's a third tab open, and I could zoom up, and uh, there I am. I, I knew I was on this page, so there's a lot that can be done. Uh, I would just set up ahead of time, set up your tabs, and uh, the, the order is you can change the order you can move them around think about what you want to talk about and you say i just love youtube and what i use it is to bring people to my business and the way i bring people to my business is to use a capture page in a system that sends out automatic emails so in this case i have three tabs that i would use for my recording now, what I like to do is not have my bookmarks all in there. So I would move the tab, or I'd move my window and shoot it so that's out of the way. And then I would include probably not the bottom or the sides. They need to be filled. So you can just move things off to the side. And now I'm technically ready and I have three tabs. And you don't see the tabs because I moved them up out of the way. So I can talk about YouTube and talk about how to use a autoresponder to attract people to an option that you know an offer that you have and that if they're interested they can find out more by you know going to that capture page and this would be a capture page so that's how to do really a screencast video you can add the video the webcam as well also with screencast o matic um, the mouse will highlight around with it'll have a yellow I don't see this now, but in the recording it will uh, show a yellow highlight around your mouse so that as you move your mouse around, that yellow highlight will remind the viewer where your mouse is and what you're speaking about. So that's how I set things up. You would just want to prepare ahead of time, get all the tabs ready. Start with YouTube if that's your first topic. Move over to your Traffic Wave tab and then move over to your Capture Page tab. And then I like to have those out of the way so you just see nice content. You're filling the screen with content. Hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you want to know more or get my other videos, subscribe uh, by clicking the subscribe button. And we'll see you on the next video. Have a great day. Bye for now.